And animals may not have those kinds of complicated views about the distant future, but animals do have preferences about what they want to be doing tomorrow. How autonomous the animal will be will vary from instance to instance. Snakes may only have very limited preferences. House flies, I imagine, have very little, if any, individual preferences about what they want to do with their time. But still, to the extent that we find varying degrees of autonomy in the animal kingdom, we will then have a second reason not to kill animals. Given then that one moral obligation is to respect and honor the autonomy of people, we then similarly have to respect and honor the autonomy of, of other beings. Now, of course, including animals. 